Now in its 10th year, ER has become an American institution. So that's why I've come to County General to interview the stars of this cult drama. Emergency, I'm following through. Start. I need a portable x-ray. Get him in here, Pratt! I need another set of hands. Got a pretty nasty head like in here. soon to do it. Noah, welcome to T4. Thank you very much. Good to be here. Uh, and you. I must admit, I do feel very comfortable sitting opposite you in case anything goes wrong, because you have played doctor for the last 10 years. I could certainly pretend to help you. Well, pretend may not be the case. I mean, you must have picked up a vast amount of medical knowledge. You pick up quite a bit, mm. but, you know, it's one of those situations where the more you know, the more you realize you really don't know. 1040.2, I can check 252. All right, full set of labs. Uh, Contestants, PCR, and culture, and blood culture. Let me put you in a situation, then. If you're on okay. a plane, yeah. and somebody was like, is there a doctor on board? You'd be like, uh, I was yeah, in that I'll situation. Yeah, yeah I was in that situation. A man was having chest pains on the back of a flight, and they made an announcement asking for a physician, and uh, every head turned towards me, and... Uh, Hi, Dr. John Carter. I, I sunk in my seat and pretended to be. <laughs> I didn't hear it. You need to sit down and roll up your sleeve, Louie. If you don't take your EPO shot, you're going to get sick again. Do you want to be sick? Do you want to end up... Hey, 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 help, security! Linda Cardellini. Yes. <laughs> it's nice to meet the ER sex bump. Oh, is that what I am? Yeah. Definitely. Nice. <laughs> about earlier, I don't want you to get the wrong idea about Luca. He's a good guy. I'm not looking for anything right now. Okay. I just thought you should know. Thank you. You've snagged the best looking guy on the show immediately. What was that, your contract or something? Or? Uh, when I... or is he the best looking man on the show to you? I'm not sure. Uh, he's great for Sam. They yeah. work out well together. Mm. I think they have a fun relationship. Sometimes I just feel very passionate. Kovac, uh, he's been through some real changes. Uh, he's just come back from Africa. How do you think the man himself has changed? Those uh, two Africa episodes, I would say, they were really extreme. And uh, mm. Kovac was in certain situations. They were, like, uh, really nasty. I mean, guy almost died. Yeah. Definitely not a happy time. But uh, I would say it changed him for, for good because, you know, he'd seen all those things. He survived. It means somebody loves him up there. Uh, where are you going? This guy's good, and I've got other patients. Uh, Dr. Pratt. I'll be back. Mackay Pfeiffer, welcome to T4. Uh, thank you, man. It's lovely Glad to, to be here. You. Glad to be here. Your character, uh, Dr. Pratt, I mean, he's, he's notoriously feisty. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking there's a bit of you in the character. We have differences in our personalities, mm -hmm. but, um, yeah, he's, he's a, he's a nonconformist. And he's not going to take any crap, you know. He's going to give his opinions, and, and he's not going to, you know, sometimes he can be crass. Yeah. Um, but I think he does have a lot of compassion. I think he does have a lot of passion. I think he does want to save lives. I think your mom's lucky to have somebody like you looking out for her. I'm going to test your medical knowledge. Okay. If you don't mind. Adam. What is a talk screen? A talk screen is a test that you run to gauge what kind of narcotics may be present in a person. What is bagging? Bagging is uh, when you put a tube in somebody's uh, throat because they can't breathe and you have to bag them with the ambu bag so that they can uh, get oxygen to the brain. What are the symptoms of scurvy? Stomach problems? What is that? I don't know. What is a code brown? I, I never heard of that before. Um, something very serious. Let's say if something happened where uh, a helicopter blew up. Yeah. And people were hurt all around. I think you, you call Code Brown and I think it helps out or something. What, what is it? Code Brown is uh, when someone uh, makes number two in a room and you got to go clean it up. They call for a Code Brown. Full marks. Here we go. 